What if I told you, you can transmit 1080p video or gaming wirelessly up to 20 feet with zero latency? But with this product from Peekdo, you can. And today, we're gonna test this out with the Samsung Galaxy S10, as well as a Surface Pro 3. We'll transmit the video to a big screen TV or a monitor. And yes, of course, we'll test the latency as well as the range. So without further ado, let's get started. This is a wireless 1080p HDMI extender from a company called Peekdo. This extender has a wide range of applications, from PC to Mac to mobile phones, game consoles, projectors, and cameras. What makes this wireless extender unique is that it transmits in the 60 gigahertz range, and this is also referred to as MM Wave technology. And since this MM Wave technology is rarely used, the 60 GHz range is largely free of congestion, resulting in better signal integrity. Let's take a look at the contents of this wireless extender. So while we unbox the contents of this wireless HDMI kit, first, let me preface this by saying, Peekdo sent our company this wireless HDMI kit for free for a review. And to be 100% honest, we have never heard of this company. There is not much information about Peekdo, but we are fairly certain this is a Chinese company. We have reviewed wired HDMI extenders, and we relish the chance to review a wireless HDMI extender, especially with the claims of 1080p at 60 gigahertz at zero latency. And this wireless HDMI extender is 179 on Amazon. And there are currently four reviews on Amazon, all are five stars. And one of the reviews says it does not work with an iPhone. And I can't verify that because I don't have an iPhone. Like I said before, we'll try this out with a Galaxy S10. And my plan was to test this with my Surface Pro 3. However, things have changed. I decided instead to try this out with my PC because I want to test it out with some gaming. And this way we can test the latency. And guys, don't forget, if you like this video, give a thumbs up and share it. Thanks. So guys, this is everything you get with the Peekdo Wireless 1080p HDMI Extender. Now it's time for the all important test. We're gonna try this out with a phone and my desktop computer. And we're gonna test both the latency and the range of this extender. So our first test will be with the Samsung Galaxy S10. Let's go ahead and connect the transmitter to the phone. And FYI, when connecting the transmitter to the phone, make sure the peak dose symbol is facing away from the phone because the transmitter's antenna is on the side of the peak dose logo. And to ensure the optimal range of this extender, both of these antennas need a clear line of sight. So no large object should be in between your antennas. And as you can see, we tested the 20 foot range and it worked pretty well. So right here is a sweet spot. It's about maybe seven, eight feet is really a good spot to, to stream this. Anything further away is a little bit, a little spotty. It's not perfect, but it does work. Here's perfect. But over here, when I get, maybe I've got something that's blocking it. I don't know if it's these weights. I went back and measured with the tape just to be accurate, and I found that 12 feet was the sweet spot for this area. However, in an open room, I found between 18 and 20 feet worked well. The trick is you can't have anything in between these antennas. So now we'll test it out with some Candy Crush. And I'm pretty impressed, it's very responsive. There's no lag or latency. And you might have seen our friends over at Linus Tech Tips they review the pro version of this wireless HDMI extender, and that extender's range is around 100 feet. And Linus did a latency test playing the game Counter-Strike. 
Now we're going to do the exact same latency test, but I'm going to use Minecraft and we'll do a side by side to compare the wireless signal versus the wired signal. One thing to notice as well is this green light is on, means you're good to go. If it's a red or blue, um, there's an issue. Our desktop PC is under our desk. So the receiver and transmitter are pretty close together. Otherwise the signal wouldn't work, it'd get blocked. So now let's play some Minecraft and we'll test the latency. And then we'll compare it to Minecraft with a wired HDMI. And let's see if we can tell the difference. And so far it's pretty good. The video looks pretty smooth, not choppy. You know, I gotta say, it's pretty impressive. There's no latency here or lag. And to be honest, I thought there'd be some sort of visual issue, maybe some choppiness or some lag, but there's not. And like I said, during our test, there's zero latency. Now, once again, the transmitter and receiver are fairly close together. I think about two feet, only because the PC is under my desk. I really have to say, this is really good. I, I was expecting it not to be this good. When you think of wireless, you kind of think of latency and lag and less responsive. However, it's the exact opposite. This does feel like a wired connection. And once again, through our testing, there is zero latency at 60 frames per second. And we use the NVIDIA Reflex Latency Analyzer. It's a great tool to analyze latency. And once again, we get zero latency and no lag, which is pretty impressive. And just a fun fact, did you know radio waves through air are faster than electronic signals through wire? So I guess we shouldn't be too shocked at the quality you get with a wireless HDMI extender. And I'm not sure if you noticed, but we switched back to the wired HDMI cable. You probably did notice. So this product is the real deal. While there's not a whole lot of information about this company, Peekdo, or is it Peekdo? I'm not sure which way to pronounce it. This product is legit. This product is pretty impressive and the technology works well. Just keep those antennas clear of any obstructions and you'll be just fine. And one more thing, the reason you didn't hear any sound is that my monitor has no speakers. But if there were speakers, you'd hear sound. So guys, we recommend this product from Peekdo or Peekdo. And of course, there'll be a link in the description below to where you can buy it. Well guys, we're all done here. And as usual, I want to thank you so much for watching. And I want to encourage you guys to visit my Patreon page, where $2 a month helps keep this channel going. And remember, if you like this video, give a thumbs up and share it. If you love it, hit subscribe to keep this channel alive. Thank you again for watching. I really appreciate it.